This video will demonstrate how to give yourself an injection under your skin, which is called a subcutaneous injection, or a sub-Q shot. With this kind of shot, you use a small, short needle to give medication into the fat right under your skin. First, gather all of the items that you'll need and place them on a clean surface. You'll need an alcohol wipe, a 2x2 two two sterile gauze or cotton ball, a container to throw away the syringe and needle, a heavy plastic detergent bottle with a lid or other solid container will work, and a Band-Aid. Of course, you'll also need the medication. Read the label carefully to make sure that you have the correct medication. Make sure the dose matches what your doctor ordered and check the expiration date. If it's expired, don't use it. Call your pharmacy or doctor's office to get a new one. Now clean your hands with either soap and water or an alcohol-based hand sanitizer. If you're washing your hands with soap and water, wet your hands, apply soap, rub them together thoroughly for 15 seconds, then rinse. Dry your hands with a disposable towel and use that same towel to turn off the faucet. If you're using an alcohol-based hand sanitizer, be sure to cover your hands with it, rubbing them together until they're dry. Now you're ready to give yourself the shot. You'll need to find a site where you can pinch a one to two inch fold of skin. If you choose the front or side of your belly, make sure you give the shot at least two inches away from your belly button. You can also give the shot in the middle front or middle outside of your thigh between your knee and hip. Or if someone is giving you the shot, he or she can give it in the back part of your upper arm, between your elbow and your shoulder. Do not give yourself an injection near any surgical scars or other injuries. Once you've found where you're going to give the shot, use the alcohol wipe to clean the area. Let it air dry. Don't fan or blow on the area. Remove the needle cap with the hand you do not write with. Now use the same hand to pinch a one to two inch fold of skin between your thumb and first finger. Hold the syringe in the hand you write with the way you would hold a pencil or dart. Holding the syringe firmly, quickly push the needle into your skin. Use a 45 degree angle so the needle will go through the skin and into the fat. Slowly push the plunger to give the medication. When all the medication is in, Take the needle out of your skin at the same angle you put it in. If you have any bleeding, put firm pressure on the site. Hold a sterile gauze pad or cotton ball over it. Once the bleeding has stopped, put a dry gauze or bandage on the site. Don't rub or massage the area. Now put the syringe and needle into the container. Write down where you gave the shot. You can use a calendar or notebook, whatever is easy for you. This is important because you'll want to use a different site each time. Giving shots in the same spot will cause scar tissue to form in that area, and that'll make it hard for the medication to work. It will also make it hard to put the needle into your skin. It's normal to have some bleeding, soreness, mild bruising, or redness at the site. But you should call your healthcare provider if you have bleeding at the site of the shot that doesn't stop, if you have very bad pain, if you make a mistake and inject the medication into the wrong area, or if you develop a fever or signs of an allergic reaction, such as swelling, redness, itching, or rash. If you have any problems giving yourself the shot, or if you have any other questions, call your health care provider.